Hello, welcome to another speed building video using MovieZoo. Today we're going to show you how to build a campfire scene. Now the first thing we did here was to put down the rug object and turn it dark red. This creates the underside of the fire. Now we don't actually have any logs in MovieZoo so what we're going to do is use pencils from the school category and turn them completely brown as you can see and you just want to stack quite a few together to look like the logs of the fire. Now, the next thing you want to do is create the boulder object and scale it down and just put it all the way around the rug. This gives you the classic campfire uh, look. Now, around this, because it's a campfire, it's going to be out in the forest, so we want to add some trees around about there. So, create a couple uh, circular rows all the way around this campfire so that you've got some depth of trees coming in to the camera view. Now. Instead of going on and keeping on adding trees and trees objects and tree objects after another, we can create a backdrop and put the backdrops in. And this way we can quickly put in multiple trees that really build up the depth of the scene. And as you can see we just put them around in a circle again. And really the focus is to get the depth of, um, the, depth of the scene in there. So we want to put a second row of backdrops in. And once we get all of these backdrops in, as you can see we're about halfway done now. Uh, the next thing we want to do is then uh, change the ground, so we've got a nice bit of grass on the ground, uh, again just keeping the whole forest natural theme, and then we want to put a nice sort of dusk starlit uh, texture in. Now to actually make the fire work, what you want to do is create a spotlight, and you want to use the new feature of MovieZoo, which is to make lights flicker, and you want to maybe put three or four of these spotlights in, and each one you want to choose a different sort of shade of red, orange, yellow so that it's all flicker in there and it actually looks like a fire. Above that fire we just put in a normal light which creates a bit of ambience and means that the scene never actually goes black. And there you have it, now there's your fire. Now in order to actually create this as a campfire we want to put a few more bits of detail in. So we've put some pebbles to one side, we're putting some grass here and there uh, and even a little bit further back into the scene we'll maybe just put a few bits of grass just to create the sort of detail in the background. And um, after that we want to put some uh, items around the fire because it is a camp after all. So there you go, we've got some boxes in and we'll get some tin cans in there. Um, so it actually looks like it's been used and people are camping out there. And that's it, quick and easy scene for uh, a campfire. Now here's a nice little animation. Uh, actually made using this scene. As you can see uh, we've got this uh, fat man coming running in here and he's obviously really quite scared of something. He's you know he's out in the forest on his own and he's just with a campfire and there's a monster coming up behind him. Anyway there you go a quick and easy scene made in maybe 10 to 20 minutes. All using MovieZoo. Good luck with your own.